So you uh, you, you must do do, you do your your uh, you know, uh, we call it your chores around the house and stuff, the watering and everything, and then uh, you have breakfast before you come in. Uh, usually not. So you come in just on the coffee and then you bring your kind of a snack and lunch while you come in because you get in here like around around eight, eight thirty, right? I've been Nine. Running, I've been running out the door without it. Okay. <laughs> I, I gotta, but you, you come in with your uh, cooler. You come yeah, in with your cooler. I got to start doing that again. Okay. Because after, after drinking the coffee and putting an hour in a, just on the mat yeah. training, all of a sudden it hits me mm. and there's nothing to eat. So mm. I, I've got to. I'm too excited. I'm walking out the door and mm. <laughs> getting here. Yeah, get here. I go, just take the coffee and go. Mm. You know, so. Uh, and then after you train, you have lunch at home? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I eat at home now. Okay. What's a typical lunch? You said you're vegetarian mainly, but some fish as well? Yeah. Fish. Uh, I'm trying to get fish. I eat raw oysters and buy at the mm. farmer's market. Nice. I'm doing a, a dozen raw oysters just about every week now. And uh, those are pretty zen. I open them myself. I got my little French oyster knife. Mm. Pop those suckers open. And uh, that's enjoyable. But it's uh, it's just, I think jujitsu has made me slow down mm. from a very fast lifestyle I've had all my life. Just going, going, going. And I've got that. Now that I've got the black belt it's just kind of like i don't know if i was in a race mm. you know to get there but now i'm just saying i can collect myself and i feel like there's been pressure taking off for for a goal that i don't think i really should have looked at mm. as much as i did mm. you know, i bought i bought that i got that black belt i strapped down i bought it with the kanji ride, and I bought it two years ago. I hung it on the wall where I train at the house mm. all last uh, year be, during COVID. I was there, and and I just said, okay, you're not giving up. <laughs> you're not giving up. Right, because COVID you was, know? you couldn't train, like, Don, you, you didn't leave the house, right? Um, yeah, my wife and, and I, we... we and, uh, and you would, you know, we stayed in contact with texts and stuff, and yeah. you would send me your dummy, you know, dummy yeah. pictures <laughs> yeah, and the, the yeah. stuff you were studying at home, you know? Yeah, I went through, uh, I bought 40-some videos from BJJ fanatics mm. and I'm you know I'm kind of glad I had that time because I went through 40 I went through all the good ones and mm. then I bought a lot of ones that I'm going my god these people shouldn't be training mm. a teaching mm. and uh and it was good for what it was but mm -hmm. there are certain stuff I just there were so many high level guys that contradict what they were trying to sell uh, some guys just to put their name out there and I think BJJ fanatics now you can go in and make your video and right right uh, they're, uh, you know, they're involved with in, yeah. yeah a lot of people are they, and they're starting to do that mm -hmm. but uh i was able to uh yeah i got i got I probably put more hours at home than i did do did here over the years just in uh it was a pool house i had i i bought i had I had bought some uh a zebra mats mm. and i had an area about i think it was about nine by twelve and I had about, I had made two or three dummies that I had made, worked my leg locks with a fiberglass mannequin dummy, and I was building the shock mm. of the uh, bones hitting my wrist, and my bones are very thin, mm. uh, and they're sharp. Mm -hmm. So I, I noticed when I was wrapping my hand around the ankles of this female mannequin dummy, mm. I mean, it was it was nailing me, and I, and I just kept going with it. I, I figured this is good, this is good, mm -hmm. and... Uh, I was were, th in, were there any thoughts? Like, go, go ahead and finish. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, it was it was a, it was a good experience. It was mm -hmm. like uh, it was a test. It was like being able to gather as much information on a subject mm. as I could possibly do. Hide myself someplace up in a cave mm. and just where nobody bothered me mm. for hours. And then mm. when I was done, I'd go back. Even in the evening, I'd go back and. Uh, uh, and work me and a couple of rats <laughs> i we were, you you would text me right and you're like i'm you know let, letting me know that you're still in the game and you know like just positivity to you know there was a few of us in the text chat right uh, like yeah i'm gonna you know, come back i'm gonna be back soon and see you on the mat yeah the best is yet to come um was there any any moments like man i'm, I'm 
maybe I'm not going to get my black belt. Maybe I'm going to have to stop doing jujitsu. You know, is there any of that? I know I didn't look, I didn't look at it that way. I looked at it that I had to keep doing this uh, over that period of time. Uh, and I, I included certain people that I had trained with mm. and I, and I knew, uh, there's a couple that haven't come back mm. and uh, they're still, they're pretty freaked. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They're, they're like, they don't, they don't want to go out and which I can't see. It's, it's, uh, uh, I finally, finally uh, decided to come back. I think it was like the first of March this year and I haven't worn a mask. I don't wear a mask outside. Mm. I walk into a, I walk into a restaurant and people look at me and a couple of people have come over and said, you know, you got to wear a mask. And if they get really, or you can sit over there, mm -hmm. and if they, you know, if they're really going to cop an attitude on me, I just leave, or I go, you know, they'll hand me one, and I'll go, okay. But uh, uh, I, I'm sure you heard the story, talked about it. It's, it's, I mean, it's real. It was real, and it still is real. But I don't think it's as real as people were saying, as far as people. My opinion is because you got vaccinated and then you got the booster shot and yeah, you know, I got that, that and you got and you still got you guys got it <laughs> right yeah, <they laughs> and you're did. like yeah thank God I got it finally what 